Hey guys, so it's Cool Tracks here, and today I'll be showing you guys my Amiibo collection update for 2017. So as of this recording, it has been about three years since Amiibo have released November 21st, 2014. The first wave came out alongside Super Smash Bros. for Wii U, and uh, ever since then, I've really, really liked these figurines. So basically, they're like toys to life, but the cool thing is, is that they do stuff in many different games, and you c and you do different things in different games. So it you basically when you buy one, you'll get you know it's gonna be used in future games too and a lot of older games and it's just really cool. They do some really cool stuff in some games and other games not so much. But their the main purpose for me is not actually using them themselves but just having a figurine uh, of a character I really like. So ever since I was little, I always loved action figures and stuff and figurines in general. And I thought when I was little, I used to play Smash Brothers Melee. Uh, and I just look at the trophies and same thing with Brawl. I thought it would be super awesome if they made figurines based off of the trophies in the game. And that's literally what Amiibo were for Smash Brothers. And even the ones that are not part of the Smash Brothers series um, still look awesome. So I guess let's get right into my collection now because I've been talking a lot. Uh, we'll head to my shelf. Alright guys, so we are on the uh, Amiibo shelf now. This is where all my Amiibo are. And uh, yeah, I'll just give you guys a quick pan before I start. And sorry, this video is a little shaky. I'm not purposely trying to do that. Um, it's just, uh, yeah, I'm not that good at. I I don't know. I just I just suck at like um, recording with my hand and stuff. Uh, so I'll just try not to shake it as much. Anyways, um, so first off, we have some sprites I made of Shovel Knight and Mega Man right there. I made those right before seeing junior nine, right before ninth grade, so high school started freshman year. Pretty cool. Uh, they've been here for a very long time and let's get into the amiibo now um, the amiibo are organized chronologically from when I bought them so yeah there's really no there's order from when I bought them so yeah they just ever since um, ever since I bought my first one they just kept going in lines and that's how it is now anyways um, we have my first amiibo which I ever purchased right there Fox and Fox from the Smash Bros series and yeah, this I got this from Target. The first Amiibo came out. It was the one I really wanted. So, yeah, um, it's my first Amiibo I ever got. Way, way back in uh, when November 2014. So, yeah, um, so we got Kirby and Samus. I got these two together from GameStop on the same day. I was really looking for Marth, but I never found it. And I still don't have it. Um, yeah, but Samus is a really cool looking one. So is Kirby. Well, Smash Bros. series. Almost every Amiibo has a Smash Bros. series except for two. Anyways, we got Link from. I'll just say Link. Um, this one's alright. He has that annoying yellow stand, though. We got Mario. Uh, Bowser. And behind Bowser is Pink Yarn Yoshi from Yoshi's Woolly World. Still new in the box. Um, I don't really. I don't. Really, I'm not really that big of a fan of pink, so yeah, I don't. I don't really open it, and plus it would just get dusty up here and the plush anyways. So there's really no point of opening it for me. Um, yeah, I wanted the green or the blue one, but I found the pink one. So however, I found it at a flea market, so it wasn't too bad, I guess. I got a good deal on it, the whole bundle. And I got this is not this this I got this one like this year, so it's not. I didn't buy this a long time ago. Anyways, uh, we got one of my favorite amiibos. Mega Man. That's, I remember I have a good story behind this one. Uh, I remember I pre this and I was very, very happy to finally have it. It's a really sick amiibo. It looks just like his 8-bit counterpart. So, yeah. The Bowser one, I really like the Bowser one's shell. I um, think they did a really good job on the detail. We got Toon Link. Can't really see, let me just take him out then. Uh, yeah, Toon Link's an awesome amiibo. Lots of detail. We got Sonic the Hedgehog. Yeah, I like him too. He's a really good amiibo. Um, let's see, we got Sheik. Oh, and this is one of my favorites. Pac-Man. Very well made, very well designed, very cool. So, yeah. <clears throat> Uh, that's the first row. Let's go into the second row. We got Ike, who in his original picture looked very nice, but the Amiibo ended up looking just okay. But yeah, 
And then we have, and then after Ike, I didn't buy an Amiibo for about 11 months, almost an entire year. I think, it, yeah, it was about 11 months uh, I didn't buy an Amiibo. So, yeah, it was a big gap. Uh, but I did eventually purchase one. I picked up Robin from Fire Emblem Awakening. Uh, I mean, Smash Bros. series, but Fire Emblem Awakening character. The cool thing about Ike, I pre-ordered him way back when he was available for pre-order, and it took 11 months, or about a year, for me to get him. Because Nintendo wasn't stocking the Amiibo, so... Yeah, pretty cool. Pretty funny. Uh, next up we have Rob, the robot. It's the Game & Watch. And Duck Hunt Dog, with uh, the duck. These three came in a retro pack, which you can get for very cheap now, so... Yeah. If you want Rob or Duck Hunt Game Watch, you should get that. And Mr. Game Watch actually has a bunch of poses. Um, I'm gonna go get those real quick. Those are really dope. Uh, here they are. We got um, the parachute one. Got this one where he's sort of like tumbling. And and I think that's the main one. But I replaced it with the bell one. And we got the hammer one. So yeah, um, this is really cool to get. Um, I feel like they did a really good job in making the poses because if it was just it was just like this, it was just like the flat, people would have not really liked it. So I think it was really cool that they included those. Anyways, next up we got Falco. Uh, really awesome and designed. Uh, I love Star Fox. So yeah, and we have Lucina from Fire Emblem Awakening Smash Bros. series. Um, I love Fire Emblem, so yeah, she's a really nice design amiibo. The cape is really dope also and the detail and everything so yeah uh this is one of my favorites right here we got pit so yeah the wings and everything look that nice uh here we got corin fire emblem fates this is the male version as you can clearly see there's also a female version which looks pretty dope wasn't able to ever find that one though here we have cloud final fantasy 7 um, there's also the Final Fantasy VII Advent Children version, which is from a movie. That one looks pretty dope. Uh, but yeah, the Cloud's awesome. One of the best looking amiibos. You got the Buster Sword. Looks mad dope. So, yeah. And the second one's also done. Now we get into the, uh, few more I have. We got Greninja. Um, Greninja, one of my mains. Probably my main or my second main. One of my top three mains in Smash Bros. Yeah, I guess you'd call him a main, and he is one of my favorite Pokemon of all time, so there you go. Very happy to have a Greninja. <clears throat> and we got Dr. Mario. Um, Dr. Mario, you know, he's a doctor. Not sure when he got his, uh, when he went to med school, but uh, I'm not sure I trust him as a doctor, to be honest with you. Um, and here we finally have uh, Meta Knight from the Kirby series. Of There's also a Smash Brothers Meta Knight, but uh, I wasn't able to find that. Uh, the Meta Knight from Curbs is pretty dope, though. It's pretty, pretty cool. So, not complaining. Um, yeah, guys, that's my entire Amiibo collection. Um, uh, not, not like too crazy. Not like I, I know a lot of people have like hundreds. Uh, I just, I just buy the ones I like. To be honest with you, uh, there's still a bunch more I want to get, like Shovel Knight. As you can see, I'm a Shovel Knight fan. And uh, the other Shovel Knight bosses, uh, Plague Knight, King Knight, and uh, Spectre Knight Amiibo. I love Shovel Knight, so I really want to pick those up. Um, I want to pick up Alm, Celica from Farm Week, from Echoes, Roy, and Marth from Smash Brothers Fire Emblem. What else? There's a bunch more I want to get. Mewtwo. So, yeah. And just drop my calendar. Okay. Get that late. So, yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you want, make sure to leave a like. Comment down below what you think of Amiibos. Uh, comment down below what you think of my collection. Uh, make sure to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Make sure to follow me on Twitter, Instagram. Links will be in the description below. And yeah, once again, thank you guys so much for watching my video. And I'll see you guys next time on more videos. Peace.